All right, guys, Crypto Kurt here with another update for the 10x pay tokens. And I can tell you this, after about 20 takes trying to produce three videos, I feel like I know this company inside and out, which I guess ultimately is a good thing. So in just a little bit of uh, history for you here, in the first video, I basically miscalculated the annual payouts because I took the monthly payout and then time, I'm sorry, the annual payout and times that by 12 times. And one of my readers uh, politely pointed that out to me. So I went back, marked that video as incorrect, uh, did a second video where I used the uh, correct um, values and payouts. And then I had several people asking me uh, with regards to the number of actual tokens that were going to get paid out. And I assumed that it was the circulating amount. And if we have a quick look at um, 10x here on marketcap.com, the circulating supply is 104,661,310 page tokens. The total supply is 2,005,218,256. And so a number of people asked me, well, is the payout based on, on the circulating supply or is the payout based on the total supply? So in my previous second video, I did the calculations based on the circulating supply, but I did round up to 105 million tokens. But that's yet again incorrect. So what did I do? I asked the question several times, so I reached back out to uh, the people at uh, 10x for some answers. So I'm going to answer a couple of questions uh, in, in this video as well. So my first question to them was, well, how do we get paid out? In other words, how do I make sure that I'm registered so that if I do own pay tokens that I am going to get my percentage of the 0.5%? If you're interested in what the 0.5% is and what 10x is all about, please go watch the previous video. I didn't want to redo that yet again. I'm just going to redo the calculation point bit and uh, use that as a follow-up. So they're going to be paying out 0.5% of their total uh, total revenues uh, or total transaction um, uh, revenues to uh, to the token holders. Okay, and the way that's going to happen, the easiest way that's going to happen, this is the answer that came back from them. All you have to do is store pay in your own private wallet. We recommend my Ether wallet. But any Ethereum wallet that supports ERC20 tokens will work. There's nothing else that needs to be done to become eligible. Our smart contract will automatically send out the ETH rewards to all wallets holding pay. So that's pretty exciting unto itself, guys. The, um, the, the payouts that you're going to receive are going to be in Ether, all right? So in ETH uh, values. So that's exciting as well because again once again I can't imagine as the years progress forward that the value of, uh, of ether is going is going or ethereum is actually going to go to go down so now I've come back in and I said hi Brendan you know I've done a promo video check it out um, I've had a number of people asking me if the payout calculations should be based on the circulating supply of tokens this is what I assumed or based on the total supply and then I just made a cheeky comment interesting how the day after I published the first video the token value went up 57 percent. So I posted that on a Sunday morning here in Australia, and they came back to me straight away. So they must be working late on a Saturday night. So thanks for the promo. Uh, the reward calculation is based on total tokens, okay? And then he says jokingly, let's see what happens after I post another video. So yet again, I made another mistake, but I'm glad I'm going through all this, and I'm glad I've got some really smart um, people who are watching these videos and asking asking the questions and then I'm turning around and going back and asking the question so one thing I've learned from this experience is you know we all sit here behind our computers and you know we, we think that you know it's hard to reach out to these people it's impossible they're big corporations blah 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 well really you know most of these ICOs they're in complete startup mode and they're looking for every bit of PR and, and promotional material that they can get um, even if it's simply people doing free YouTube videos you know promoting the um, the, the token itself. So, you know, just don't be afraid. If, if you ever have questions, you know, if you want to do research, if you if you are reaching an I, researching an ICO and something doesn't make sense or the white paper doesn't stipulate something like exactly how do I register my coins, you know, reach out to these people and ask them. I mean, they're, they're real humans on the other side of um, those emails. So yet again, I'm going to have to redo this video with the correct calculations. And so what I've done is I've taken the actual um, total supply of tokens. Now, <clears throat> before I go down this path of looking at some of these numbers, I was reading a very interesting article on Steemit where a gentleman was looking at the trying to do some calculations on what the value of the tokens were going to be in the marketplace. And just so you know, uh, three days ago I purchased my first 102 tokens uh, for $1.22 each. They're currently trading uh, three days later at uh, $2.21. So 
So that's up 38% today, um, but they're up uh, again from $1.22 to 221. What's that math? If we say um, uh, 1.22 and we divide that by 2.21, we're asking what percentage of that. So the shares have gone up 55% in just the three days that I've owned them. So again, it's pretty pretty exciting just to see that. So A, you've got the capital appreciation coming from the coins, all right? So or the tokens. So as we go through this math, you're going to see that these tokens being traded at $2.21 and there's not even a payout happening yet. What's going to happen when the, the system actually starts paying you out and it starts paying you out in Ether? So again, it's, uh, it's pretty amazing. So let's take this back down to my 260 just so you can see some reality. This is the numbers. The first three sets of numbers are what the company is putting forward as their guidance. The year 2021, I've just done for, again, shits and giggles to see what happens if we double that yet again and try to get excited about what might happen in the future. But if I just do the 260 tokens and they do hit the 1.2 billion in transaction fees and they pay out the 6 million across 205 million, 218, 256,000, uh, sorry, 205 million, 218,000, 256 tokens, you'll be getting paid out 3 cents per token. That's a total monthly payout of 63 cents and total annual earnings of $7.60. Let's say that they do go up to 20 billion in transactions. We're looking more now at, uh, what's that, 10 million in payouts, 49 cents per token, 260 tokens, $10.56 per month, and $126 in total earnings. Again, guys, this is passive income. You're doing nothing but holding these tokens. 2020, they're expecting 100 billion in total uh, uh, transactions. Uh, that's going to be uh, 50 million payout, $2.44 per token, 260 tokens, $52.79, 600 bucks a year. And if we go out and use my crazy number at 2021, we double that again, double that again, we're doubling the payout, and you're looking at $1,266 in total payouts. My original goal was to try to get 2500 and at 2500 we were going to be spitting out about a thousand a month, but again, unfortunately, we're now calculating with a much higher amount of tokens that are going to get paid out. So, 2,500 in the first year, uh, $73 in earnings. Uh, in the second year, $1,218 in earnings. Third year, $6,000 in earnings, and the fourth year is $12,000 earnings. And again, I just mentioned this because that's $1,000 a month, $1,000 15 a month, which would pay for my car, pay for my mobile phone, and pay for my internet, and leave me a little bit of coffee change afterwards. So there's many ways to play this game, guys. You can A, buy and hold. You can buy and reinvest and start getting some serious compounding. So every month you get your payout, you turn around and buy, in this instance, $6 worth of tokens, $100 worth of tokens. So it's $6 a token per month. Next year, $100 per tokens per month. On and on it goes. So you start growing your capital base of tokens, which of course by default is also going to grow your annual earnings and your dividends that you're going to get from these. Don't forget, you're getting paid out in ETH. So your tokens, while the number of tokens won't grow, your ETH will grow. And as I stated earlier, I can't imagine the value of Ethereum three or four years from now is going to be less than it is today. It could be. I'm no market oracle, but it looks like the uptake on the Ethereum platform is uh, is going to increase. And you know, a lot of people are getting excited about it. I don't know if you've seen all the hundred or something companies that have signed up to be involved with the Ethereum platform. But again, I just can't imagine the value of Ether going anywhere but up in the future. So once again, you've got income from the tokens. You've got the market cap of the tokens going up. There's a concept called net present value. So once these tokens start producing income, there's actual, uh, you know, a real accounting calculation, a financial calculation where you can look at the future earnings use a discount model, percentage model, and come back to what the value of the share should actually be. Um, and then, of course, you've got the emotional value tied to that as well. So you've got the net present value plus the emotional value. Again, I can't imagine that these shares are going to do anything but go up, especially when they start producing these revenues. Now, a couple of points as well. The monthly payout, if you read the white paper, they actually want to improve the, the timing of the payout. So they want to go from monthly to weekly to daily and then eventually hourly. So how cool would that be to be running around with your, you know, your app tied to your exchange and every hour you're seeing your Ether grow, your Ether grow, your Ether grow because you're getting your payout from your number of tokens every hour that they pay it out. Again, that's going to be really exciting. So as I said, lots of ways to play this game. Um, if we go to my 5,000 number, this is where I was at before. So within three years, you put in $5,000, you're pulling out $12,000 a year. It's $1,000 a month. 
you leave it in there another year, you're pulling out $2,000 a month. And again, this is assuming no, no growth, uh, no um, compounding growth whatsoever. And hey, if you're a high roller, put in 50,000. 50,000 after three years, you're pulling out 121K a year. If we can forecast this into year 2021, again, you're talking about a quarter of a million dollars a year in passive revenues, which is just some amazing money. And if you want to stop and think about the opportunities here, think about Visa. Okay, Visa started in uh, 1958, and it currently has a market cap of 234 billion, I think. And uh, they're doing something like eight trillion dollars in transactions annually. Now, you couldn't even imagine the kind of money that would be coming out of a platform like this if they were actually paying out that kind of money. We can only hope that maybe 10 years from now, this company is doing a couple trillion dollars in um, in uh, numbers, you know, in in, um, um, in transaction volumes, and then we're all going to get 0.5% of that. Maybe I'll do some crazy videos, uh, do, do a video about how crazy it could get in the future if you look at some of these numbers. But as I said, if you look at the numbers the companies put forward for 2018, 2019, and 2020, this is their speculation. So I think at the worst case scenario, if we go back to get my 5,000 built up there, and I'm going to be pulling $1,000 a month um, within three years. So again, $5,000 investment, you're then pulling 1,000 a month potentially for life. Um, it's a no-brainer. All right, guys, so Crypto Kurt here. It's time to take action. As usual, today is the first day of the rest of your life. All you have to do is get started. The first thing to do is go buy some of these tokens. There is a link to CoinSpot, which is a, a exchange, a, a, a coin um, alt coin exchange uh, that you can sign up for. Go through the verification process and just get started. Just you know, buy a couple. They're only a couple bucks each, so you you can get started with. Uh, you know, it's a great thing about these cryptos. You don't have to have hundreds or thousands of dollars. You can get started with ten bucks. So as I said, take some action. Crypto Kurt out.